inventory lumber items are a little bit different and you have a little more flexibility as far as available on projects. We also have, besides available on projects, we have match design component length. But let's discuss available on projects first. In your inventory, we've already discussed that you can set up your tracking level based on how you purchase it, Crate Pro uses level A. But many companies will have different units of measure or length for their particular materials. In this example, on my 1x12s, I have 24 inches, 8 foot, 10 foot, and 12 foot boards that I say I keep in my inventory. If any of these don't apply, you can just go ahead and delete them and they'll go away. If they do apply, let's say I have 16 foot, I generally can just type in the number and then Crate Pro will add it into here. Why do you want to have these different units of measure? Well, there are two reasons. One, for available on projects and the match design component length. The available on projects we discussed in the previous video. If I sell 1x12s directly from my inventory outside of what I would put in my crate design, I would check the box that corresponds to the lengths that I would sell. I can add a different description if I want to. Let's say I'll just put in Toodles here for that length of 24 inches, or I can say 24 inches. Now, if I go, I've got this checked. If I go to the project, I add item from inventory, and this was the 1x12s. Okay? I have the option, one right now the 24 inches selected with my description, but my drop down will show the other two lengths that I said I will make available and sell as items on my inventory. Okay. If you do not sell, we'll stick with 1 by 12s. If you do not sell these different units of measure, okay, through your inventory, you can go ahead and delete them. But before you do, you want to look at the match design component length. If these boxes are checked, Crate Pro is going to look at the particular length of lumber that might be needed for your design. And if it determines that you would use a full 1 by 12 by 8 foot, or 1 by 12 by 10 foot, and I selected those two because those are the two boxes that I have checked here, then it will reduce the number of saw stops that would normally be used to cut that material. So at any point, if you end up checking match design component length and Crate Pro can match it in a design, then your labor time will be reduced. Keep in mind, if you don't keep any of these materials in these lengths in stock, you're going to end up probably needing to go ahead and cut another material or a longer length. And if you've got match design component length checked, what will occur is that you will have, Crate Pro will have removed a saw stop, the labor time associated with it, and you still have that saw stop in place. So you want to use this wisely. If you uncheck available on projects because you do not sell this material in these lengths, you do not care about matching the component length, you can simply just remove these completely because there's nothing here that's applicable to you. It's not available on projects and you are not going to match the design component length. The material does not need to be there.